Now once you're able to get project to identify what your summary and subtasks are, we can then move ahead and apply the outline number format, or what's also referred to as the WBS, or work breakdown structure. Now you could say, well, why do I need another number format? I already have the numbers over here. Well, this doesn't really break your uh, task down in that when you go from task 2 to task 3, what does it tell you over here, the hierarchy of these tasks? It doesn't. I'd have to actually look over here to see, oh, that's right, this is bold, this is a summary task, and these are indented, so they're the subtask. But if I apply the WBS, which will be great in reports, what that will do is it'll take a number, like it'll assign this the summary task, let's say the number 2, and then it's subtask, instead of going sequentially 3, 4, 5, 6, it'll go 2.1, 2.2, 2.3, .2, and so on. In fact, to turn this on, just come up here, click on the Tools menu, go down to Options, it's on the View tab, come down at the bottom and check the box Show Outline Number, and click OK, and there you go. We have our 2, and then we have our 2s, and then we have our 3, and then our 3s, 3.1, 3.2, so like I said, later on in reports, I'm able to break this down and go, that's right, I may not have the indents in my reports here to let me know that this is the summary task, but I know that when it's a 2.1, 2.2, that those are subtasks to the uh, summary task, which is just plain old 2. And that would be your work breakdown structure or your outline number format. Now, as a little side note here, you notice that they have these little minus signs. Well, if you don't want to focus on uh, certain parts of your project or you want to be able to see parts of it without seeing others, just go ahead and click on that minus sign and it'll collapse all the subtasks underneath that summary task. So there's a couple of minus signs. You can even collapse the whole project there and expand it. Also, you can come up here and click on the show drop down arrow and say all subtasks so it pops everything open that was collapsed. Or click on the drop down arrow and just say, I just want to see the first outline. In which case, it'll just show our milestones and all our summary tasks, not the subtasks. So let's go back to all. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel, get notified of the latest videos, and for only $2 a month, you can have access to all my Microsoft Office training videos.